Dr. Darian back with us. And this seems like something out of a sci-fi movie, but this is something <laughs> we're talking about. AI implanted in the brain to help with Parkinson's disease? I think that this kind of study is fascinating. So a new treatment advancement for the, for the treatment of Parkinson's disease involving artificial intelligence. So Parkinson's disease, a progressive neurological disorder that results in movement disorders, stiffness, and tremors. Right now, unfortunately, there is no cure, but there are medications that can help suppress symptoms. And there's already in use deep brain stimulation, which is a procedure where we implant electrodes into the brain that suppresses the symptoms. Uh, what what is the difference between the use of AI is that that deep brain stimulation delivers a continuous signal. So it's not specific and different for each patient's needs. Using artificial intelligence, they were able to use that with this deep brain stimulation to create this adaptive response that can be specific for patient needs, helping possibly the million people that are living with Parkinson's disease. This is a small study, but big results. All right, so what else can this be used for? You know, well, deep brain stimulation is used for a variety of different disorders, Parkinson's disease being one of them, but also complications like epilepsy, even OCD, uh, obsessive compulsive disorder. And so if you think about it, it's one of those opportunities for artificial intelligence to help even more people. Yeah, we're so scared of AI in some ways, but then in other ways, it's really good for us. That's exactly how I felt when I read about this. It's 100% it's hits it on the head. It's, uh, there are moments when you fear fearful, but there are moments when you have great hope, when you have technology that you can use with patients like this. Technology. All right, doctor, thank you very much. We appreciate it. Of course. And folks,